Hello fellow YouTubers, today in this video I'm going to be reviewing the new Mario Kart Hot Wheels Princess Daisy in the Wild Wing and the Bowser in the Standard Kart. Now previously we received a Bowser figure in the Standard Kart, but this was of course uh, the variation of the glider. So yeah, really cool to see that we got a Bowser in just Standard Kart plane without the little um, peg right here in the little port. And as well, we got Daisy for the first time, really looking um, awesome. Really great looking figure as well. So really excited that I found this. I found this at my local Target and I am in California. So if you're looking for this in the US anywhere, it is confirmed to be in California. So yeah, I found this at Target, of course, and Walmart. I've been checking. Some people have said that they found it at Walmart. Um, I haven't found it there. My, it might because my Walmart usually is slow on stocking up but yeah I've been around a few Walmarts in different cities and didn't have anything I've been looking for these figures for about um four to five weeks now and I found Bowser first I only found him um it was very early it was about two weeks ago I found him or about a week but as you can see in the back this is what I seen I always seen that there was um the series, but they didn't have um Princess Daisy because I guess people had bought the character, and I was there um or I was too late I should say, kind of messed up. But yeah, enough of me blabbing about how I got this. Let's get these unboxed, and I'm really excited to open them. They look amazing, and just the packaging, just the Daisy, the detail on the figures are very fantastic. As you can see, just how it looks when it's packaged and as well one thing before i open these i found quite a few and i had to buy them all because you know there's a bunch of people selling them for 35 dollars. i'm not going to do that of course but i'm going to keep them now it seems like these figures are getting much more common i remember the first person that sold it or had it on ebay was like selling it for 70 dollars, or someone was selling it for 70 dollars, which is insane but yeah i'm just gonna open these up real quick and I'm going to show the rest in a minute. So here are the two of them out of the packaging looking amazing. Now I don't know if this lighting is too bright but it kind of covers the little um shadowing. Now the shadowing for me it gets a little annoying once in a while but hopefully this isn't too bright for you guys. Um, So yeah let's take a look at them. I may have to refocus but as you can see here's Princess Daisy. I'm going to get better focus in a minute but Here's the two carts, um, really cool. You can see the shadowings there again, but looking at the characters look really, really great. I really like the paint application, and I'm glad that they use the um, Mario Kart Wii um, um, vehicle. Really cool, and it's a repaint. It's not just the red cart. It's actually daisies um, with that sunset orange, the sunset orange colors, and the aqua looks amazing. Aqua is one of my favorite colors, the greenish blue. And just the silver wheels are um, amazing. So yeah, let's get it in with some comparisons and might do some more in-depth detail in a minute. So yeah, let's get in. Um, let's get in the Kidu. Or actually, let's get in the princesses first. So first we got, um, let's see, where's the cart set? So we got Peach and we got Rosalina right here. Rosalina was um, an exclusive. But sadly, um, now she's in the, um, in a four pack at um, Walmart or Target. You can find her. So yeah, um, the rarity of her has just gone down, but she's still really good. Um, really great figure. I think there's another one coming out in um the birthday girl cart, which is um either gonna be pink or her color, which is um blue. So yeah, it should work out. I think it's gonna look nice. I'm pretty sure they're gonna pick the color that matches with her, like they did with Daisy. So yeah, let's get into some of the other ones now. We're going to get in Wario. Um, kind of weird I'm going to put them here. But I'm just going to organize. I'm just going to put them all out. And I'm going to have to zoom out in a minute. But I'm just going to zoom them. I'm going to put them in really quick. I'm going to pause the video. So for a quick comparison, here's the newest edition of the Hot Wheels, Daisy and the Bowser. With the some of the other cards. These are in all of them. Now I have a lot more than this, but I'm just going to show a few of them. So yeah, it looks really good. Um, and yeah, um, really great uh, figures. I'm really glad that my collection has been expanding, and so as other people's, really, I'm um, great uh, figures. This is turning out to be really great. Um, Mario Kart Hot Wheels, 
I never expected that they would do so many, but I really like it. They're great selling items. They sell fast. They're perfect um, for younger the younger audience, even older collectors. You know, they're simple. They're five bucks. Uh, decent price. I'm glad they're not ten. I thought they were going to be ten when they first came out, but yeah, I'm going to pause the video and show them again. So overall, I think it's a great little wave. Um, they also have some extras, of course. And just um, some duplicate, I, du duplicates, I should say, my bad. Don't know why that came out like that, but duplicates. They, um, these are the new ones, of course, but yeah, really cool that they have duplicates or just re-releases of some of the other Hot Wheels from the previous series of the Mario Kart Hot Wheel characters, just for others to collect them more in case you missed them. It also makes the wave um, a lot bigger or feel more complete with a few more. So yeah, um, great little um, wave. I really like these two. It's kind of funny that Bowser and Daisy are the new ones in, in, in the same line. But yeah, really cool. I was thinking maybe a Luigi or something, but I'm pretty sure I think the next ones are going to be... Uh, I'm thinking it's probably Baby Luigi, I'm, think I'm thinking, and maybe um Bowser Jr. I've heard rumors about that, but... Looks really good. I'm really excited about this. Daisy, really cool. We got the figure finally. Um, took a long time, but really glad that we got it. And the, hopefully we get Pauline and some of the ones I have on my wish list um, are King Bomb Bomb. They've done some for Mario Kart Tour because Diddy Kong has his um, uh, Mario Kart Tour card. Uh, or his, um, it's like the pipe frame. But yeah, it looks like his Mario Kart Tour model. Um, hopefully we see some more stuff like that of Pauline and then we see a dry Bowser really would be cool if he was in the little airship It would look funny and I really want to see some more variations in the Mario Kart um, Mario Kart carts Like um, a few different ones. We've been getting a lot of standard carts lately and just re-releases and repaints of the carts um, looks really good for Daisy though, but Yeah, I really hope that they add some more maybe some bikes it would be really nice. I think so yeah, that was my video on the Mario Kart Hot Wheels, um, Princess Daisy and Bowser and Standard Kart. Um, before I go, I'm going to show the ones that I got. I found this many, and it's surprising. I probably came out um, when the stores, the stores probably just stocked it up um, when I had just got in there because it was really lucky. These figures are thirty six dollars on eBay or something, and I'm pretty sure a lot of people would have grabbed it instantly. So I got lucky and went on a lucky date. Um, a few um times before I actually couldn't get these because I seen the series it showed the little um Princess Daisy in the back which I'll show in a minute but there was no Daisy figure but it just had some of the other figures from the line that's how I knew that I was there but I missed the opportunity to get it but really glad that I got a chance to get these figures and really great figures great for any collector you know um these definitely sold out a lot faster than the other ones but it's, I'm pretty sure it's because there's a lot of Princess Daisy fans out there, and yeah, of course, um, there's probably going to be a lot more people buying this just for the character and probably not just for the series. Now, I'm trying to collect the whole series and all the Mario Kart Hot Wheel figures, and I've been doing it for about two years and a lot of other people, but yeah, I'm pretty sure that there's going to be people um, trying to collect this just for the figure itself or maybe customization or just to collect it, you know, because it's a really nice collector's item, but... If you do see this at your store, even if it's common, eventually in a f the future, because the prices are going down a bit, um, definitely recommend picking it up still, even for the $4.99 that it is, or a little bit more, depending on states or um, places, but pretty sure it's $4.99 .99 in the United States. Definitely recommend picking it up because it will become a collector's item one day, and I say that about everything I review probably, but you know... This stuff, it, sometimes it seems like it's going to be there forever, but you never know. Sometimes it might just, time might just take it over and it becomes rare and it's not there anymore. So yeah, these are definitely going to probably become discontinued one day if um, the Mario Kart Hot Wheel lineup ever ends. But I'm pretty sure it's going to be lasting for quite a few more years and hoping that it will. It's a really great um series. Hopefully we see a lot of more var variety of stuff. Really liking it though, where it's headed. Really creative. The tracks are nice. The River Road one's nice, but probably hopefully you can find that on clearance for twenty dollars less eventually. It's probably gonna be like in another year or something, or you never know. But yeah, really cool. Um yeah, forgot about reviewing the other ones really quick. I'm gonna get those in. So here's the rest of the other ones I found. I found about six of them. As you can see, I opened one and I also found about a few Bowsers, but I didn't pick all of them up. 
Now, usually when I go to the store, I leave a few for some other people, but it seems like a lot of people I've seen on YouTube have just been grabbing the Hot Wheels or just grabbing the stuff from the store. They're just like, I'm going to grab like 10 of these and sell them on eBay, but I'm not going to do that. I'm just going to keep them for collector's items. And yeah, you know, I think it's cool. And as long as you find it, I think it's, I think it's fair that you can pick them up. But it was kind of funny because... When I got these, um, some lady at the store um was actually saying as or asked got the manager from the store and said, "Is there a limit buying these?" So yeah, it was kind of weird, a weird experience. I don't know why that that would be there would be a limit on the Hot Wheels, because <laughs> I'm pretty sure just normal Hot Wheels people have bought hundreds in one day are in the same store. But yeah, I'm pretty sure it shouldn't be a problem if they're making a lot of profit. But yeah, it looks really good. Um, as well, here's a few more Bowsers. Can't stack them on the top because they're going to fall off. Here's one more Bowser. And, um, here's another Bowser. I can't hold them all at once, but, yeah. I'm going to pause, unpause the video, or pause the video again, and then I'm going to just do one closing thing. So, guys, that is going to be it on my review on the Mario Kart Hot Wheels Daisy and Bowser in Standard Kart. I know I kind of did a closing statement earlier, but that happens with a lot of my videos. Because I end up forgetting something and I add it in at the end. So yeah, thanks again for watching. If you like the content shown, a like is always appreciated. And looking at the back, you can see a um, nice little paint application really quick. And the bottom is just plain with a little bit of orange in the paint of the cart. So yeah, it looks really good. Um, You can see I, didn't, I forgot the back, sorry. <laughs> I think I did, but really nice. You can see the little logos and stuff in the wings. But yeah, really um, great figures and definitely recommend picking them up one once again so yeah um thanks again for watching the video and if you like the content shown please leave a like and subscribe if you like the content shown and yeah props to this fly because he's been watching the whole video right there see him he's just been standing there the whole time he's alive he didn't fly away once he's been there watching the whole time just relaxing chilling hearing me talk so wonder what he's thinking anyways Goodbye, everyone, and I'll be doing more videos soon.